Alright guys, Bleaker here, and we have returned with the next episode of The Legend of Steve. In the last episode, we cleared the fire dungeon, and we began this trading quest. If you want to, if you want to know more about the trading quest, please check out the, the end of the, towards the end of the last video, and I started covering. If you want to see more on the fire dungeon, that's going to be towards the beginning of the last video. But on this current video, my current objective is to finish this whole trading quest, and hopefully, I need to like lose some weight here. I need to like, frick, how do I do this? But anyways, hopefully the hopefully on this episode, I'm looking forward to finishing this trading quest and hopefully getting into the water dungeon. So I need to run around a bit here. I actually need to run around a little bit here so I can drink this soup. I also got the set of shears from the last video and there's a guy in town who loves red, who's actually obsessed with red poppies and will trade me, and will trade me uh, one rupee per red flower. So I'll run around here collecting up a few of these. So I would like to thank everybody for their support thus far on this video. I mean, this is going pretty well. Gosh, I'm going to make a lot of money. Just one rupee a flower. I mean, this... I actually rated the rupee... Oh, I don't even need... This thing doesn't wear down. That's nice. That's nice. Hey, what's this? The House of Shears. I went to the spider house to grab a treasure and I ended up being cursed instead. If you kill all 30 spiders inside, I will break the curse and I'll give you a treasure if you kill 30 spiders. Alright, I don't have much left on this sword. Okay. Spiders. Well, this would be a good segue. I need to lose health, so I might as well. That's one spider. Hello? Mr. Spiders? I hear them all over the place, but I don't see them. Well, we might as well at least do a little bit of this. They're in the walls. That's genius. Now I know where to look. I can't actually hit this one. Might have to bow and arrow him. Nope, I missed. There we go. Wait, does that mean there's one? There's They're all over the place. Holy crap, this man's got an infestation. You, sir, have a problem. So they can literally be anywhere. There's another one. Trying to get by me there, eh, chief? Oh, come on. wonder if I can break... Nope. Come on, come on! It's so slow, so slow. You know what, this is a cool quest, but I think we might have to come back to it, because there's a lot of work to be done. I've got a lot of other work to do here, so we'll come back to this one. Yeah, we're definitely going to have to... Oh, there's one. Yeah, this is a nifty little side quest, and I will definitely come back to this, but... Okay, that's bothering me. Where's this other spider? Oh, Mr. Spider. I hear one. I don't see it. Oh, they're probably all over the place. I'm not really be looking too closely here. Yeah, I'm definitely going to come back to that. That's a nifty little side quest. So let's eat the stew here. And we're going to finish up this little trading. They call this the trading quest. So apparently everyone in town needs something that the other person has. So it started off with the jailer. I kind of went next door and he gave me something to do. So I talked to this fine gentleman here, Gorman. I get a torch. Great, thank you. So now let's see here. There's a priest somewhere in town. According to the book, yes, I cheated a little, but I'm, my cheating days are over. There's a priest around here, so let's look for a church, or something that could resemble a church. So he needs the torch for churchly things, like churching up the place. Yeah. Jaya! Nope. I have 100 rupees if you have any gold dust. Nope. Let me think here. What do you have? Wow, what a ripoff. No! My torch! My money! There we go. Oh. Oh, that could have been bad. Wow. 
100 rupees gets me good stuff. It's actually pretty good. Ooh, what's this? Nice. Nice. I'll take less than I will take no less than 200 rupees for it. Okay. You sir are outrageously priced. Revenge. What? Okay, what is going on here? Creeper, oh man, I got back to the mine. Our pickaxe swinging side to side. Okay, that was weird. Legion, everything men should know about women. I'm reading this. <laughs> it's actually kind of funny. Legion. Who's Legion? A random story by Draco. Okay. You people are weird. I mean, you people are really, really weird. What am I looking for now? I'm looking for a church. This looks like a church. Bless me, Father. Or I have... Ho there, Steve. A great mystery is afoot. Yes, it seems... While most individuals spend their lives being decent and honorable people, a certain individual... A certain individual... A certain person lacks this. How do I know this? A fellow ran off with one of the torches in the church. Now the place will forever be uneven. Here. Take it. Ooh, gold dust. Is that the end of my trading quest? How does one spend a hundred rupees? Do tell, how does one spend 100 rupees? Some gold whoopies. Some whoopies. Oh, there we go. Aww. 100 rupees. Thanks a ton. No, thank you, random citizen. But I can still no still not afford that. That's kind of weird. That I cannot afford that, um... Not what's it called? Oh, whatever. I still can't afford that, because I don't think there's like a rupee equivalency exchange program in place here. So I have to look into that. But in the meantime, while these shears are unbreakable, you know, I might as well collect up some of these stupid little red flowers. And these stupid little red flowers are about to make me 12 rupees. Now, this is... Like, sir! And I said, sir! How many more of these would you like, sir? I mean, he'll trade me one rupee for him. I mean, this might end up be how I end up raising all my money. So I've got 20 right now. I think I need about 50 for that respiration armor so I don't die. That actually looks like the water temple down there. So I did not set my alarm again. Gosh darn it. I'll give it another, I'll give it another 10 minutes. Since I'm not feeling as pressed for time this episode. But yes, I start school tomorrow. Like, I recorded this episode and the last episode at the same time. So I start school tomorrow. That's pretty exciting. Well, nothing, I'm not taking anything overly the top interesting. I already took all my primary courses, my robotics course. I already took all that stuff. Yes, I'm doing robotics. Yes, I'm a nerd. If there are any questions, comments, or concerns, you can take it up with somebody who cares, I'm sure. Red flowers, 25 flowers. I want a few more of these flowers here. A graveyard. Zelda game. Historically, this never goes well. What's here? Oh, a cookie. A skull mask? Protection bones. So I need 20 cookies and I get the, um... Cool. I need 20 cookies and I get the really kick-ass bow. That thing's got infinity and stuff. I need 20 cookies, so... I will definitely do an exploratory episode where we just go around the world looking for stuff. Ooh, what a pretty building. I'm going to go investigate. Da -da -da -da. Oh, next to a not-so-pretty building. What is... What is this? This is cool. What is this? Are you even a thing? What are you? What secrets and mysteries do you hold within you? Oh, thing that may not even be a thing. Oh, 
Oh, I can't get into this thing that may or may not even be a thing. Oh, what's this? This looks like a thing. It is a thing. Oh! You, sir. You, sir, are a thing. Hello, Jeff. I can't believe it. I moved out here to get better view of the sky. Once I get my cannon up and running, I'm good going up there to kick his butt. Oh. Ho, ho, ho. Oh, that makes so much sense. That's how we get up to there later in the game is we're going to... We're going to get up there. Ah, ha, ha. Oh, you guys are so clever. Ooh, a cookie. Okay, I know I said I'm not exploratory questing, but I had to make an exception on that one. I need to eat. Collect this flower. How many will I have at that point? I should have 50, which should be enough. But there's also a pair of swag boots. Kind of want the swag boots. I think I'm going to get the swag boots. I feel like the swag boots are going to be a necessity to my quest, so I should probably gather up a few flowers and prepare myself for my swag boots. I also need to find a way to get 200 rupees. Another set of 100 rupees. How will one... How does one get 200 rupees, you may inquire? Uh, but... We'll find out. So I think I like doing the smaller Minecraft maps better than like these big maps everybody's done. For one, the smaller Minecraft maps usually have... Usually the creators come and find me and they're actually really cool people. Like that's how I met Mick and I got wrapped up in his stuff is... I did his map just randomly. I was like, this is a cool map. Other than the bigger maps that are done by all the big wigs like this one is and you know... You don't really get a lot of support from the map creator. Like I haven't heard anything from the map creator yet. I mean, I'm sure he's a pretty cool guy, but... Usually, you get something from the map creator. Either that or my video just must be really hard to find. But, you know, I think I'm going to switch back to doing, like, the Minecraft maps that are done by, like, the smaller people. You know, this if you've got a this channel smaller, you know, kind of a cult following right now. 41 subscribers. I Somehow I've suckered in 41 people. I don't know how you guys found me, but I appreciate that you guys have. One dude, this dude, like, made my day. He said, I hope you make it big on your channel one day. And I was like, I don't remember what your name is, dude, but that right there, that made my day. And I'm... That gave me hope for the future of my channel. Oh, God. No, stop! Stop! Too much experience! Is there, like, a grand exchange here? Like, if I get enough rupees, I can... I'll have to look that up if there's like a grand exchange on this map. Ugh. Come on, let me talk to you, buddy. Did I did he throw me something? Respiration. Oh, I have way more rupees than I need. Nope, mine. Where does this guy come from? He just kind of spawns. That's cool. Come on, let me select you. I want to own you! Oh well. I think I'll pick up another sword. Come on, I wish to give- I wish to give you currency! The pickiest freaking shopkeeper I've ever met. Thank you. Three, four, five. I want one of these. Perfect. Oh. Sorry. It's like it's not letting me select it. Sir, come on, man. Okay, maybe I'm not allowed to p pick it. Inspiration 3. Okay, then I guess we're... Trading quest. I'm all done with that now, right? I've got nothing left for this, right? You'll need to go to the fishing pond outside of town and catch a fish. Bring the fish to it and he will get you a second diamond you need. Oh. You'll need to go to the fishing pond 
outside of town and catch a fish. Bring this fish to... How do I get a fish? Where even is there a fishing pond outside of town? Actually, let's go find this nice gentleman. Where the heck do I have the number 9 next to my name? That's kind of weird. Alright, so where do I find this fine gentleman? A procure a procure of fish, if you will. Billy! Oh. Potion of instant healing. You know what? Let's purchase some steak here. Why not? I've got the money to do so, because I'm exceedingly rich. You know what? Here, let's mix this stuff. Okay, what else we got here? A villager who doesn't want to give me anything. An information center I'm not really interested in right now. What else we got here? That's the library. This is the church. Leave it, leave it, leave me some deliciously fresh... something deliciously fresh. Okay! Leaving you something deliciously fresh. How do I get a fish? How does one procure this... fish? Where even is this fishing pond outside of... outside of here? Hmm. Where does one even find this? fishing pond. You speak of this Amy fishing pond. Ha! Doctor Who reference. I I have no friends. I'm sorry. I have no friends, people. I have no friends. I'm a shut-in. People are weird. Remember that, everybody. People are weird. They're quite strange, indeed. Uh, yes. Oh, yes. Yes, I'm yes, quite straight strange. Oh, yes. Yes, I'm yes, quite. Yes. Yes. Whee! Well, that seems like something, but this also seems like something. My something is confused by this something. So let's go over this way, see what this is. Maybe this is the town fishing pond. If not, it's a really big fishing pond. Like, I mean really big. Like, you people have a lot more money on your hands if this is your town fishing pond. Oh, fishing pond guy. Hello, welcome to the fishing pond. Oh. fishing pond. Don't litter, walk quietly. What are you going to do? You're a sign, not a cop. I've never actually caught a fish before. This is kind of exciting. This is really boring. Like, I mean really boring. Like, I'm literally sitting here waiting for something to happen. We're going to go on the deep end. Alrighty, well, I guess I'll have to catch my fish later then. But I would like to thank you all for watching this episode. When we come back next time, hopefully we will... Well, I'll probably already have my fish captured, because to be honest, it's going to be kind of pointless of you guys sitting here watching me fish. But when we come back next time, hopefully I'll catch my fish. But I would like to thank everybody once again for watching my videos. It really means a lot to me that you've even made it this far, even considered making it this far. So until next time, guys, this has been Bleaker, and be seeing you. Thank <laughs> you.